Hello, I just wanted to record a few thoughts concerning my Herat Mod tools. Um, basically, they are just a pack and unpack set of tools, similar to the GNU style zip and unzip. Um, for this demo, I have just placed them in my game directory in the tools folder. So you can see pack and unpack there. I'll just refer to those from the command line here. So let's just get a listing of what's in our pack file. So let's just do dot slash tools slash unpack. And then let's point dash L for a listing and then Herat dot pack. This will give us the listing of all the files, uh, specifically the, the size in bytes and then the name of the file. This is the total bytes and total files. This is useful. Uh, you can also pipe this info to the clipboard and paste it somewhere like a notepad or wherever, um, just for your edification later. Um, but what we're going to do is we're going to extract these assets. So let's just do a dot slash tools, uh, unpack, and then let's say um, we want to unpack uh, that info and we wanted to specify an out directory with the dash D uh, and say out. And this will extract everything to the out directory. Um, also, let's go ahead and back up our existing uh, hrot data. So I'm just going to use the move command. Uh, this is a G and U command. I use a MSYS, uh, but it shouldn't really matter. You can figure out a way just to copy it over, but uh, hrot.pack to hrot.pack.backup. Sure. Uh, so we can see now that we have our executable and our backup of our data. We're going to go into the output directory. Um, these are all just the files, so I'm just going to round trip this. So I'm just going to pack this back up and give it back to the game actually to make sure that it works. So you can just do a ls or a windows, you can do a dir slash b. You're going to pipe that into um, the unpack or the, the pack command. So pack.exe and I'm going to just say dot dot slash rot dot pack. And this will uh, recreate um our data file so we go up we do a ls dash al um so the, the the pack the newly created data file and the, the backup should be exactly the same size in bytes this is important and if we run rot the game if everything works fine it should load and uh yeah we'll be playing we'll be playing this very cool very brown game uh, hopefully this gives a brief example of how I use it. There are some fiddliness with if you want to replace files, they actually have to be the exact same file size, but uh, I'll try to cover that somewhere else.